What a travesty. I wouldn't be surprised if you paid the judge off. You want to know the best thing about leaving this town, Hank? Never seeing you again. And don't bother waving goodbye. I wouldn't want you to hurt your finger. Mr. Snyder, thank you. I kept up my end of the bargain. Now you keep up yours. Get no his sight back. You should be in prison. Don't worry, I'll be out of here just as soon as I wrap things up. What would it take to get you to change your mind? About what? Leaving town? I respect you a lot more than I dislike you. We could certainly use you at the hospital. Well, you're being generous, calling that place a hospital. We do the best we can. But you haven't answered my question. What would it, what would it take to keep you here? Well, let's see. How about a state-of-the-art neurosurgery unit, a ridiculously outrageous salary, and a title with the word genius in it? How's that grab you? You drive a hard bargain. That I do. Good luck, Dr. Hughes. I wish I could say it's been a pleasure. Oh, my God. The guy is so arrogant. Well, I can't... sometimes people are good enough that they can get away with that. You know, I wish I could uh, offer him what he needs. Me? I say good riddance. Well, it didn't do us any good. I don't have the kind of money at the hospital to give him the kind of surgical unit that he needs, and that's too bad. What if I said I might know where you could get that money? What? That's a lot of money, Bubbles. What are you doing? No, 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 no. Do not even think about it. Not me, no. Uh, excuse me. Henry, come back here. No. Henry, listen. You can follow me from here to Chicago, Katie. It won't matter. There is no way in hell that I'm funding some new neurological unit just to keep that low-life, good-for-nothing Reed Oliver here in town. Why not? What is the difference? You don't want the money. I know, but I don't want to keep Dr. Jekyll around either. Well, forget about Reed. Think about unburdening yourself of that Stenbeck money. The closure that you claim to want no, 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 is just no, 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 a no, no, signature I, 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 Stop, stop. You're not getting under my skin. Not this time. It won't work. This is just the kind of beautiful gesture that Vienna would want. You're playing the Vienna card? That is a low blow, Katie. That's a low blow. Stop being so defensive and listen to me. This is your chance to do the right thing. Where was your sense of doing the right thing when I offered to give the money to Jacob? This is so different. R really? How? How? Because that was passing blood money onto a child. This is doing something good for other people. Reed put this idea in your head, didn't he? No, absolutely oh, not. Oh, yes. Don't you see? He's just using you to get what he wants. It's classic manipulation, Katie. You're Katie. really taking me off. I can't believe this. If you won't even consider doing this, you are not the friend I thought you were. Now, that sounds suspiciously like blackmail. I wonder where you picked that idea from. This has nothing to do with Reed. Stop using your grudge against him as an yeah. excuse not to do the right thing. Oh, wow. I cannot believe it. How low will you stoop for this? You know what, Katie? Maybe you're right. Maybe we really aren't the friends that we thought we were. So, did you tell Noah the good news? I did. Good. Listen, I know, given how much you hate me, that it wasn't easy for you to come to my defense today, but your testimony got my case thrown out. I appreciate it. Well, I did what I had to do for Noah. I couldn't have you going to jail. He needs you too much. Can we try this again? Thank you. Promise me something. Never, ever try to bring me back to this godforsaken town. The sooner I'm on the plane home, the better. But you're gonna operate on Noah before you leave, right? Actually, I'm gonna leave just as soon as I can get a flight out of here, probably in a day or two. But what about- Don't worry, Noah's gonna see you again. He's coming with me. Hi. Hi. Hey, any luck with Henry yet? No, not yet, but I'm not giving up. Well, on behalf of the staff of Memorial Hospital, we wish you the best of luck. Mm, thanks, I think I'm gonna need it. You know, I didn't think Henry had any interest in keeping the Stenbeck fortune. Well, sometimes what Henry says and what Henry does are two completely different things. Mm. Well, if there's anything I can do to convince him that we could really use that money, just let me know. I will, thank you. But I think I might have another idea. Oh, keep in touch with us. I will, okay, <laughs> bye. Vienna? Hi, it's Katie. Tell me it's not true. Luke, calm down. Calm down? You're going to Dallas? Dr. Oliver's gonna operate on you there? The guy might be able to give me my sight back. What difference does it make if he does it here or in Texas? Well, the difference is, is that I'm here. Your life is here. This is your home. 
I'm not moving there permanently. It's just until I finish with the treatments. What else are they gonna do? Was I gonna say no? I can't believe he played me. I testified for him and he turns around and pulls a stunt like this. Luke, this is about me, not about you. It's about my chance of being able to see again. Okay, can you just, can you try and remember that? I know, I'm sorry, okay, just, I just want you here. Ah, you're still here. Yes, I am. Listen, no, it's gonna take me a couple days to wrap up my affairs here, but then we're free to go. Great, and uh, thank you again. You know, I'll be right back. Wait, Luke, Luke, please. Dr. Oliver, please, can't you reconsider? Reconsider what? Can't you operate on Noah here and then go back to Dallas? You want Noah to get his sight back, right? Yeah, that's what this is all about. Then step back and let me handle Noah's case as I see fit. 